Hello everyone, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make your own $10 cable caster. Now if you do a lot of wiring and, you know, just general wiring and stuff, you probably know what this is. The Greenlee Cable Caster. And you probably also know how expensive it is. $80 just for the cable caster, which is actually a very simple design. Spring and a dart, and it shoots a fishing line across the room. Well, I'm going to show you how to make your own $10 cable caster out of simple parts you can get at Walmart. First of all, you're going to need an airsoft gun, such as this one. Then you're going to need some string, um, fishing line, regular string, it doesn't really matter. And you're going to need a, pull, a pin that pulls apart to look like this. You're going to attach it as I have. Attach the string to the airsoft gun's trigger. Attach the other end of the string to the disassembled pin. Now if you get this same kind of pin I have right here, this will fit perfectly with a small amount of electrical tape to hold the wire, or to hold the string together. Alright, so after you've done so and found a pin that fits, insert your pin into your airsoft gun. Step two, pull it back. Hang on. Can't do that with the camera in my hand. So hang on just a second. Okay. Step two, pull the gun back. It's now loaded and ready. Now there are no BBs in this gun, because so we're going to be shooting this string. Just make sure that that pin is down in there real good. And uh, the string's coming out the other end. Now, the pin is loaded. And when fired, shoots your line across the room. Now, it may not be as powerful as the cable caster, but it's definitely a lot cheaper, and depending on what airsoft gun you get, you'll have more distance. Now, you don't want to add too much string, or you will lose air, and it will just kind of fall. So, you can get a CO2 airsoft gun if you need more distance, or a spring-loaded if you just need, uh, you know, for a short room, or, or if you're just wanting to goof off. You can do this as like a prank or something. Anyway, so there you have it, the easy $10 cable caster. A lot cheaper than the $89, $90 it takes to buy this thing. Not to mention I'm going to lose your darts. Well, pen is, what, 25 cents? So, hang on. Load it one more time. Okay. Loaded. Ready. Hammer's back. Now I got this one at our local um, sports store. Sporting goods store. The Not that much distance. I'm going to do it one more time. Hang on. I'm going to make it go farther by aiming higher. And I'm going to aim up high and do it at an angle so you can see the line as it shoots it. There you go. Let's see. See how long that was just there. Now it ran out of string. It would have kept going a little farther. Let's see. That's about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and say 15 feet. We'll say uh, you don't want to add any more than 15 feet of string. Okay, so that's a good uh, measurement there for you. Any more than that with a spring-loaded airsoft gun, it's not really going to work. But there you have it. The easy $10 cable caster versus the Greenlee cable caster. Now, sadly, I'm out of darts. And uh, do not order from MRO Center if you're ever trying to buy darts for this because they're scanned. 
you will not get your money. So, you know, anybody that watches this video, by the way, just uh, report them because they're fake. The Morrow Center. Anyway, I'm going to order some new darts and I'll make another video tutorial on this. But until next time, peace out.